This is the stuff. Okay. Hi guys. Hi guys. <laughs> Welcome to her channel. Her name is Jessica Lecha, and this She's is right. the Jessica Lecha community. Now that that's done, I don't know her intro. <laughs> this is hi guys. Welcome back to my channel. Hey everybody, welcome back to my channel. Yes, as you can see, we're sitting in my living room. We're on the floor because we're gonna chill. We're and gonna she's about chat. to do a tour of her house. <laughs> Not. <laughs> we are here today. Oh, everybody, welcome a guest. This is Tato Fox. If you don't know who Tato Fox is, I am not sure where you are living. They're part of the other 80,000 that are about to join. And welcome to everybody who's coming here from Tato Fox's channel. Hello, yeah, everybody. Yeah, 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 Fox Nation. Yeah, welcome. Everybody is just, we're all friends here. Yes. This is a good environment. We're all friends here. Yeah, Tato boy. Fox is here, and we're going to talk about um, the stereotypes that are associated with being African. So, people who are outside of Africa, the, the shit they say. That basically they think about Africa or Aye. Africans. Yes. Uh -huh. So we're going to we're going to there are lots of them. Mm. I've got them here and we're going to talk about them. I married one. <laughs> you ready? I'm married for the stereotype. <laughs> <laughs> yes. She married. Then again, hey Scott. Uh, uh, don't try and find them on the internet. <laughs> don't try and find them on the internet. You won't find them. Mm -hmm. I'm, I'm kidding, I'm playing. Okay, let's get started. Okay, okay, so basically, I'm, I've got them here, Tato. Ne? Okay. And we're going to discuss each one. So the first one that I got here is Oh, so Johannesburg, is that like somewhere in Ghana? Mm, that's true, yes. It's in Malawi. <laughs> because. Because Africa one is known as a it's a country. country. It's a country, it's not a continent. So Johannesburg is pretty much ten minutes away from Ghana. Correct. Yes. Yeah. 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 It's a Republic of Africa. Johannesburg is a capital. Right next door to Ghana. Right next door to Ghana. It's the second capital. Correct. Right. And then Pretoria is just maybe a stone's throw away. Yes, and Nigeria is uh, yeah. uh, the Cape Town of Africa. Yeah. 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 It's yeah. one country. Correct. So, so do you guys like live amongst lions and hippos and do you sort of like have them when you walk out your door? I do. I do. <laughs> I, I do. I got a lion as mm -hmm. a pet tiger. Yes. Right? Yeah. Yeah. I got a lion as, as a pet tiger. tiger. Right. Because first of all, when I don't understand either way. <laughs> so even if first of all, you don't have tigers, but they don't know. So they don't, exactly. They're lions per tiger. Yes, yeah. Right? Yeah, yeah. And, and we ride mm -hmm. giraffes on a Saturday. Correct. And I walked out this morning and my hippo walked me to the gate. Yeah. yeah amazing stereotypes. And I won't lie, the most people who ask those stupid questions are apparently uh, Americans. They're Americans. I said it, I'm sorry. Yeah. Yes, that's true. Americans of course. Even with the Johannesburg one, they'll say something along the lines of, Oh, so you're from Johannesburg. I've got a friend called Sipo. Do you yeah. know him? Yeah. No. <laughs> 45, 47, it might be 40 million of us. <laughs> And black people, there's so many Sipo. Sipo is just a, such a generic name that really, are you seriously asking me if I know a Sipo right now? I know 10. You know, so 10. I'm not sure if the Sipo you are talking about is the Sipo I know. She knows 10 in this area. Correct. Not what about the Africa is hot? I don't know what people expect. <laughs> it's like going to the Antarctic and being like, oh, it's so, oh cold. God, so cold here. Yeah. Oh my God. So cold here. What's going on? How do you guys survive? Now, That's Fuzzy, not all of Africa is hot, though. Good yes, man. it's hot. We don't dispute. Typically, if you're coming from England or wherever, or Antarctica or Greenland or wherever, Scandinavian countries, you might find this hot. Yes. We also find it hot, but we don't find it ridiculously. Have you been near the equator? Mm -hmm. It's a different kind of hot. Mm -hmm. There's hot, humid. There's hot, dry. There's hot, but really, dry. Thank or your you. clothes stick onto you. Thank you. Oh Humidity, God, heat there. From the moment you get out the place, just like, woof. <laughs> if you want to, if you want to understand it's Dubai, terrible. go to Durban. Yeah, go to Durban. Times yeah. by Firstly, Africa is hot. Really. It's diverse. It's diverse. But my thing is, Africa is known for being warm. So when exactly. you come to Africa, what do you, you expect? expect? 
what are you expecting to see it's what like, are you expecting to feel yeah. what are you expecting to you know yeah i mean if you want to pack a bag and you go into the arctic you would wear a jumper you would wear snow boots correct why would you come to south africa with a jersey correct and if you want to just in the middle of summer go to the shops but <laughs> i mean that's the obvious the, exactly in the middle of summer you yes. come to south africa wearing a jersey getting what, off the plane in on. a jacket really come on you know i understand somebody who's like oh it's so cold mm. i didn't expect it to be this cold <laughs> but oh it's africa God. baby it's africa it's hot here it's hot it, it is what it is yes. there's level there's degrees of hot yes, yes. there's going to uppington and it's like 45 and then it's been job back it's like date or 28 yes there's someone told you so creepy you didn't lock the door oh no i didn't <laughs> imagine if there was somebody at the door jesus okay i'm taking over the show just like my friend i'm taking over the show so africa is unsafe and dirty india's also dirty america's dirty Every place is dirty. Yep. They're all dirty. China dirty. Have you been to some areas in Have these first world countries? God. They don't even like they don't even show you what these places look I've like. I've been to Venice. It smells. They are rats. It smells. It's nice to see it in the in the thing and be like with a guy on the gondola. Water and gondolas and this and water taxis. It smells. That water actually smells horrendous. So And I'm if you're on if you're if you're on the boats at night when they have their little lights on, you can actually see the rats running across <laughs> on the walls. So I didn't sleep the first I night I, I was know. there because I was scared of the rats. Yeah. So let's calm it down. Let's let's bring it down a notch. Bring it down a notch. Let's bring it down a notch. Africa is also dirty, but yes. if you come to Santon, or, or, or if you no, fuck Santon, if you go to Soweto, yes. most places are clean. Clean. Are clean. clean. Proper. Yes. Proper. So I don't know why what we're supposed to say to to Africa is unsafe and dirty. Oh my gosh, my things, my 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 bags are gonna get stolen. My this. So there's not it's crime where you come from. But we're not going to and like dilute that there's crime in South Africa. Yes, there's crime. We are well aware that there's crime in South Africa. Yes. However, there's crime everywhere. Have you been to Brazil? Oh my God. The there's stories. Crime. There's ah. crime. I haven't been there, but I'm scared myself. There's crime. Because there's crime Brazil. everywhere. Yeah. There's crime everywhere, guys. Mm. You know. Um, in London, there are stabbings every other day. Mm -hmm. ne? Wow. So they don't put that on the news that, hey, London is here. Exactly. Hey, this guy. No. But you come to Africa, you're worried about your purse. Ne, exactly. What are guazans in London? Like, like, like in London, all your underwears, all your underwears, all your safe. What are guazans? I'll take it back. Anyway, the gist of it is there's crime everywhere. There's so crime everywhere. saying that Africa is unsafe and dirty and whatever. Okay, no, no. You you you're grouping so many countries and towns and townships and suburbs in one and saying that it's dirty, saying that the whole thing is dirty. No, no. Yeah, and 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 countries are diverse. You can't mm. look at one part of a country and just generalize that this is the whole country. Correct, correct. There's some places that are all, Pretoria, as opposed to Johannesburg. Pretoria is clean. Yo, Pretoria is clean. It's, you would swear it's a whole entire different government. Oh, it's a whole entire different country. I'm scared of Pretoria. You're scared? Pretoria reminds me of Cape Town. For the reason why you said you don't like it. It's Town. racist, yeah. I have. It's the, 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 we're not even going to so take that away Pretoria from anything. Not. Pretoria is racist. I, I don't want to be well. talking to her. <laughs> I don't want So, have you ever noticed on CNN and all the Sky and whatever, whatever these news channels, when they focus on Africa, they show the little kid with the <laughs> with the fly on the mouth. Jesus! I don't know what to say. Like, like, Help like, me, please. They show the little kid with the fly on the mouth and a big, big, big the kids with Koshiko, 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 right? Big belly. That's what Koshiko does. And flies on the mouth. Skinny, skinny legs. Mal just nourished. can't walk. Malnourished. And that's apparently Africa. That's my number one pet peeve. See everything we listed there? Mm -hmm. Okay, I understand. Mm -hmm. Marat, you know how many times I'm sitting watching I TV that. and then an ad will come on. Oh, if you spend one mm -hmm. pound Africa my, needs assistance. You can help a child in Africa. Yep. And the child the Mpungani is just, 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 just I mean really? 
how many how many people do you know that let a fly just just they don't, they don't, just even like, babies it's like, they get irritated exactly and, and we need to help if you could donate just one dollar one dollar could feed a family one dollar okay. and 14 rand <laughs> <laughs> One dollar, you know this. One dollar is fourteen, 14 rand. rand. Okay. So, will this feed our families? No, it won't feed our families. It won't feed our won't families. Tell but the thing is, that the opportunity. So, if a photographer taking this picture, why are you not asking for? For like exactly. Fly? Well, well, I think that there's a photographer taking that picture and going yeah, instead of like, oh my yeah, god, the baby. Yeah, yeah, the baby. You know? the ba the they like, take it the away and then take fly. the picture. No. no. Instead, they, they choose to take it. Yeah. Yes. They, they want to portray more of, you know, these desperate countries. But this, I mean, and maybe it does help people get money, right? Mm -hmm. But I just feel like, okay, we. It we, perpetuates the stereotype that Africa is in poverty and this and that. Yeah, well, how many people of them, like celebrities, are coming and they're like, damn. <laughs> Is this Africa we're talking about? Exactly. Then they have to take the, they have to drive their cars to the lion park there. Move, move, exactly. Walk, yeah. And then see those animals. Because I don't know what they think. They think we like. We walk around with them. Walk around with lions. And we then walk around with lions. They're, they're our friends. Yeah. They think yeah. all the time they're going to find little kids with them book on this Sunday. <laughs> they said so they're like, oh, you've got an, you, you've got an airport. And then we got the biggest airport in Africa. The no, we don't have an airport. I took a, a ship. <laughs> I took a ship to get to you in, in Italy there or to you uh, in America. Ba 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 like it's honestly really, really it's it's comical. To the thing is to anyone who's not African who's watching this, when you say things like this, comments like this, to us it's actually damn near comical. Irritating. It's irritating, it's comical. <gasps> you know what's irritating? Oh, yeah. Do you speak the click language? <laughs> Bitch! Are you crazy? Really? You know how many languages? Nigerians in, in its own has black like a hundred languages. Black, black, there's over 2,000 languages in Africa alone. 2,000 or something like that of the other. But Nigeria has clicks. Corsa has clicks. Now Black Panther messed us up. Because, uh, because of... <laughs> you speak the click language. Oh my God. I'm, I'm always like, okay. Do you understand that language? I'm always like, classified, but okay, I understand, but I'm petty. There's no. not even one click. Maybe, I, maybe half a click. Not in, not even in Sutu. <sighs> not even a click. My grandma needs to call Zulu people ma, ma tulu. That's how <laughs> not Nguni we are back at home. Like, so I, I, there's so I, I many find languages that aren't even, it's very, very ignorant. People, I think, yeah. Do you know? Do you know the click language? First of all, if you're gonna ask me about a language, please learn the name of the language. No, because I don't know what the click language is. Even, even, even aside from that, imagine when Scott, if Scott is here, and then well, Scott's a bad example because he's not from here. But a white person who goes to America or whatever, and then they say they're from Africa. Really? But you're white, baby. There, are, there are white people here who are born and raised here. And I know some people are of the they mind that... They are white Africans. Yeah, so some people are of the mind that Africa, that there are no white Africans. Yeah. But if they were not yeah. born here... If they were born here... Yes. What they, are they? Yes. If they yeah. were born, born here, where are we going to put them? Yes, exactly. Oh, how do we classify them? So do we just call them white but not African? Yes. So do we drop the whole... Okay, yeah, he's white, but he's not really African. But he was born in South Africa. Yeah. Or Namibia. We understand or, that he's got roots that... His past roots are from Europe, from Europe, right? Yeah, yeah. But he was born in Africa. He was born here. Yeah. So he's a he's a white African. What is he? He's a white African. He's a, white African. He's a Caucasian African. African. But at the and end of the day, say, do you say Caucasian African or do you say European African? No nah, hell no, white <laughs> African. I actually don't like being called black. What do you want to be called? African. Brown. No, I want to be called African. Why? Because I'm hundred percent African. I don't have any mix in me. I don't, so I'm African. I'm not black. I feel like I, maybe because of me, I just got the thing. I, I don't like being. I don't like color. I don't like being like putting people in boxes of color. I know it sounds crazy. My little sister loves to say that. No, um, we're not black. We're brown. <laughs> yeah, and I'm just like. And my son is the same way. He's like, oh, no, we're we're brown black. people. I, I get it, but I feel like black is a name that the oppressors gave us to like to be able for us to be able to like distinguish between this is a black person, this is an Indian person, this is a white person. I don't so like the do? term so black. I just call myself African because I'm a purebred African. Pure. That's that's fine. Same lineage. Then... So 
if you want to but be then you see under African, but under African, but under African you you we can put in I'm white southern colored African. black i get and the no, african we but, can put in the different skin tones as well yeah that's so why i white. asked you do you call them european africans or do you call them caucasian africans or do you call them white. you said what season because you want black african you want black so are you black Europe. african i'm black african no but that makes no sense i'm black though but you are known as oh brown <laughs> i don't want to be technical oh brown what then whites are what pink they're peach. <laughs> <laughs> but at the end of the day, whoever isn't African that watches this, it's really annoying. It's very irritating. It's very ignorant at the end of the day yes. for you to have such narrow-minded views and opinions about everything and everyone that comes yes. out of Africa. So Africa comprises of multiple countries. How many countries are there in Africa? Oh my God. You're going to cut 40, this up because you don't know. 40. I don't know either. 40 something. No. <laughs> No, it's 47. How embarrassing. You don't know the answer. We're from South Africa. Do you know how ignorant South Africans are? Oh shit, 54. 54. 54. Ooh, 54 oh, she countries. cut out Cameroon, Togo. She cut out yeah, Togo. <laughs> but there's 54 countries in Africa. Africa is not one country. country. Africa is a continent. So if you are coming from somewhere, educate yourself, please. So then wh what do you feel about, um, oh gosh, now this is like, it's become a controversial. What do you feel about those people who, um, so I, I saw some girl in yeah. America yeah. who was saying that she is not African, okay. she's American. Marhaka Mubona. O black. Uh, basically <laughs> and then she spoke about how black people are like this and she's I not think I saw that there's a there, there are a yeah. lot of the um so a lot of Af african americans mm -hmm. uh, british americans mm -hmm. whatever they associate african africans as being mm -hmm. uh what is it what's the word uh, like almost barbaric, almost being like uneducated, oh, or do you know what you know, animalistic. I forgot the word, yes, yes. The word. Can it animalistic, yes, yeah, yeah something like that. Yeah, it's yeah. funny because in one of my videos where I talk about being 30 single and black, yeah, some American guy, mm. black guy, responded and he said, You're not black, you're African, you're from Africa. And I'm like. What? You, you look darker than me. What the fuck? Like, what? What is your what? What? What's the? Okay, I gave him a very vulgar response. I did not swear, but I gave him a response that he can go take home and think about. <laughs> you know. But for the most part, I'm just like, so Americans, the, the African Americans would justify themselves as being black, whereas black Africans are not blacks. They're Africans, yeah. but yet we have the same skin tone. Yeah, what so, is it? We're Africans, so we come from a, you know, a country where there's ignorance, and you mm -hmm. know, we are still wet behind the ears. Mm -hmm. Whilst mm -hmm. they are black American, they have had schooling, but they're just the skin color is. We've already been talking for twenty two minutes. How oh, long do you think this video is going to be? Oh, Sus. Jesus! Exactly. This is why she's efficient because I would have talked forty minutes and tried to. Mm-hmm. Already me narrowing it down. I know it's probably gonna be like 21 minutes <laughs> or 18 minutes. But anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Tell me if you uh have heard different stereotypes uh that are in relation to what we've been talking like about. Like black men got big dicks. Yeah, they've got that's a stereotype. Apparently, African that's men have got true. big bananas. Hmm? Not true. It's not true. <laughs> it really isn't true. <laughs>
It's an anti-egg anti series. Egg, yeah, anti-agony series, series every Friday on mm -hmm. YouTube. Yep. So make sure you guys, make sure you guys Pop in there, in. say hi. Say hi. Tell, tell them where you're from. Send you. yeah. Yes, oh. tell them that I sent you. Fox yeah. Nation, pull through. That's right. They, it's a 10,000 by 2. <laughs> All right, so we're gonna go now. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, but me and Tato got things to talk about now. So, <laughs> and things to do. <laughs> so we'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks Bye. so much, guys. Love you. Bye.